Many of our local elected representatives sharing their reactions to the Supreme Court's decision today. KLBK's Landry Senna spoke with some of them. Landry, who'd you talk to and what they have to say about all this? Well, Terry, Charles Perry, Jody Arrington, and Dustin Burroughs all sharing pretty much the same thoughts on this, that they believe this was the right decision and one that corrected a mistake made 49 years ago, they say. It's a, it's a victory for the Constitution today. We made a lot of headway the last few years and we knew these days could come. I, I, I'll be honest, I didn't see it really coming in my tenure as, a, as a, an elected official. It's an awesome process to be a part of. Lubbock lawmakers Jody Arrington and Charles Perry say the Supreme Court's decision to overturn Roe v. Wade was the right one to make. I think there are resources available uh, to counsel women and to provide uh, services to them. We need to have uh, adoption services and programs and processes that make it uh, seamless for a transition of that child. So what exactly does this mean for Lubbock being a sanctuary city for the unborn? The law has been given back to the states. That's just basically an umbrella, if you will, solidifying the decision of the sanctuary city for the unborn. This means each state will now have the option to effectively ban abortions. In Texas, the one exception for having an abortion is if the mother's health is at risk. These lawmakers believe this decision will save millions of lives of unborn children. I'm just pleased that we have a court that got it right and that honored and upheld the Constitution. We, we stood up for what God treasures most, and that's his creation. And State Representative Dustin Burroughs releasing in a statement saying, quote, This day is long overdue. Life is the most precious gift from God, and millions of lives have been ended before getting an opportunity to experience this gift. In Texas, the unborn will finally be protected for the first time in my lifetime. The Texas legislature has continued to strengthen services across the state to help women access health care both prior to and after the birth of their children. If more needs to be done, I welcome that conversation. End quote, Terry.